Hi everyone and welcome to Home Reno Collectibles where today we're going to be doing an unboxing from Kapow Toys. As you can see, it kind of gives away what one of the things is in here. So now there's five items in here, or at least there should be anyway. One of which is obviously Marvel Legends, as you can see what it is on the box. Uh, and then uh, there's two more Marvel Legends in here. And there's also going to be two uh, Transformers items in here as well. There we go. So first, let's just get rid of all of this packing. And it looks like everything is in here. So we'll save what you obviously know is in here till the last, because I think it is the best thing. So there's two Transformers items in here. So let's go ahead and take a look at those first. They are both from the new Titans Return line. So we have uh, Fracas and Scourge. So an awesome new looking Scourge. And then we also have Blur, and he is with uh, Hyperfire. And this guy just looks absolutely fantastic. I love the look of these new uh, Titans Returns figures. Blur, and he is with uh, Hyperfire. And this guy just looks absolutely fantastic. I love the look of these new uh, Titans Returns figures. And the fact that a lot of them are triple changes as well, really, really um, just absolutely awesome. Like with the city modes and stuff, I don't really think it's needed for someone like Blaster and stuff. But at the end of the day, it's an extra mode and it's more playability. And that is awesome. So you can make your new awesome, uh, you know, Cybertronian cities out of all of your different sets. And I will be getting some more Titans Returns figures. Now, I do actually like the Takara ones better. But they're more expensive and it's just, I mean, it's like half the price of the figure like added on just so you can get the Takara one. And honestly, I just don't really see the point. If I want a little bit more white on my blur to make it look a bit more like cartoon accurate, I can just go ahead and paint that on myself. I really don't care. So then next up out here we have the Captain America Civil War, Winter Soldier and Falcon. Absolutely awesome to have these two. Really, really excited to see how this guy compares with the uh, Winter Soldier version of the figure. And then how uh, this guy looks with the wings all attached and everything. These Marvel Legends videos, all three of them, will be coming up tomorrow. And that is tomorrow as of me filming this video. Because this is going up as soon as I've shot this. And then here we have him. The Punisher. Oh yes, the Jim Lee style knight is Punisher. So in case you didn't know, Punisher is actually my favourite Marvel hero slash anti-hero um, and I just absolutely adore this figure. I collect Punisher figures basically. I have all the Marvel Legends versions except for the Urban Legends one just because it's exactly the same as the Series 3 or 4, is it 4? I think it's Series 4 Punisher. This guy right here, if I get him out without dropping anything, this guy right here. But yeah, from the looks of things, the only thing that I would change about this would be uh, to give him trigger finger hands and also uh, just a pistol. I My favourite weapons are pistols and so I would really, really love to have a, uh, a pouch on there so that you can hold a sidearm. Apart from that, it is pretty much a perfect Punisher figure. He looks absolutely fantastic. So, the review for this guy and for Falcon and for Winter Soldier will be coming up tomorrow. But between this video and that one, I'm actually going to do my Loot Crate unboxing right now. So you'll see this video, then this month's Loot Crate, which came to me today. And then tomorrow you'll be seeing those three. And then after that, we'll get to the Titans Returns figures. We'll get back to finishing uh, the uh, Predator NECA figures that I've been doing. And also um, the uh, Combiner Wars Bruticus. And then get on to Warbatron and other things just like this two-pack right here of Huntress and Power Girl. So thanks for watching guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, just giving you a bit of an update on stuff that's coming up and also uh, just you guys witnessing this opening of epicness. And before I recorded this video, I actually did an Ultra Sabres unboxing. So if you're wondering why in an unboxing later in the week, uh, I'm wearing the same clothes. That's why, because I've just done both of them at the same time. So yeah, that is it. Like I said, thanks for watching guys. If you want to see pictures of more of this stuff and anything else in my collection, go ahead and check out my Instagram. It's homerino123 and the link is in the description below. Uh, if you want to ask me anything about my collection, if you want to uh, see anything in particular reviewed first go ahead and just let me know in the comments let me know what you think about these figures and uh, obviously stay tuned tomorrow you'll see the full review so you'll see what i think 
For more reviews and unboxing videos, go ahead and subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.